Welcome back to the channel, my freedom, love, and two-way supporting patriots. So uh, this Sunday Thought episode is going to be, if you see someone with an advertised price, should they be held accountable to hold that, to sell at that price that you see listed? So this stems back to, uh, in uh, December, I was on tacticalgear.com and I was doing some online uh, shopping and actually doing some researching a, a product I had already bought and getting some of the info down and a link for it to share with you guys. And I happened to flip over to the Condor section and something was completely wrong with the Condor section and everything was marked incredibly low. So they had plate carriers that were marked down it was to I think 91 cents for entire plate carriers. Um, you know, mag pouches, uh, backpacks, like everything Condor was marked down to incredibly low prices. Um, there was a backpack I had been eyeing uh, to use as like a bug out, get home bag. And it was marked down uh, from $130 to $13 something. And so I, I threw, you know, six of those in my cart because I could. And uh, I found uh, some real cool sling packs. Um, I found five of those that were like 90 something marked down to 13 as well. And so I figured, you know, I'd keep, keep a couple, give a couple to the family, and then do some cool giveaways with them. And I figured, you know, I knew the prices were clearly marked wrong. Like, I knew that. I'm smart enough to figure that out. Um, I figured best case scenario is they have to honor those prices and go ahead and send them to me. Uh, worst case scenario, uh, the order gets canceled and I don't get any of it, you know. Over $1,000 worth of merch for 150 bucks is a pretty good deal. So... They didn't get, I didn't get any kind of notification on shipping uh, the following three days and usually Tactical Gear ships out the next day. They're a really great company, uh, despite this me telling you the story. And uh, they didn't ship anything out, no notification, so I emailed them and say, hey, you know, kind of trying to play dumb, what's going on with my order? I haven't heard anything about it. I uh, didn't get a reply. Um, emailed the next day, again, no reply. And so finally, on uh, Friday, so five days later, I called him. I was on hold for a little bit, and um, a lady answered, and she just sounds sounded so frazzled. Um, and she's like, you know, what happened was the prices got marked wrong. Clearly, we can't hold, we can't sell at those prices because we'd be losing all of our money, basically. And it's a pretty small company. And so she's like, you know, I apologize. We're trying to call all these people back and let them know what's going on and that was kind of my biggest point or biggest part I was upset about was they could have sent out like a general email to everyone saying hey you know these orders aren't going to go out because the prices were marked wrong and it was right before Christmas so I'm sure a lot of people who weren't as savvy I don't know weren't as intelligent basically were expecting to get all those uh, as Christmas presents and whatnot, and kind of got screwed over on that. So she was super apologetic, and you could tell she was just fried, like people had probably been grilling her all week. And I, so I felt really bad for her. And she's like, what we're doing is we're offering a 15% off coupon for all Condor products. And that's how they kind of made up for it. So what are your guys' thoughts? Should they have been held accountable and... Uh, sold for those crazy stupid low prices and just lost money hand over fist or did they do the right thing by canceling all those orders um, it's kind of a tough one I really like tactical gear I've shopped with them before that I've shopped with them since then uh, it's a fantastic company so I wasn't too upset about it and I was kind of already expecting worst case scenario for that to happen but uh, let me know what you guys your thoughts are on thoughts are on that one Probably rambled a little long in this one, but I uh, appreciate you watching as always. Uh, thanks and God bless you guys.